Hey guys, my name is Jesse Reds. Welcome back to my channel. Let's get into a bit more San Andreas. So what's going on now? I'll get rid of that marker. Oh, I have to go way over there? Holy shit. Okay, well. What's the best way to do that? These bikes, they're kind of buzzy. Is there like uh, anybody I can jack? Apparently not. Okay, I guess we'll take the bike then. Are there any other nice bikes? No, just uh, what are these called? Sanchez? Okay. Let's hit that ramp. Yeah, nice. Break. No money? Fuck. Okay, so roughly which way do I go? I guess I should go out here. Yeah, okay, we'll go there. All right. Yeah, I spent a couple of years in... Well, I'm going the wrong way here. I spent most of a couple of years in South Central. I spent a few weeks in the East Bay area. But apart from that, I've really only driven up and down I-5. So we'll go turn right and go up that way. So, I don't know this sort of... I mean... This looks like if you drive along I-5 between the Bay Area and L.A., it's really just kind of like relatively flat farm country. So this doesn't look anything like that. This looks pretty hilly. It almost looks more like like uh, like a rural NorCal type thing. It sort of has this, like if you drive on I-5 north of the bay, like Redding or places up there where it's actually pretty hilly and there are lots of trees, it looks more like that. So I, I don't know what they're aiming for specifically or if they just came up with a generic place. Let's see where I'm going here. Oh god, that's pretty far. Should I just keep going straight through and can I maybe cut across that road? Maybe? We'll give it a shot. So yeah, I don't have much experience in small town California. I have thought... My, my motorcycle isn't working now, but I was thinking, you know, there are some pretty amazing roads in NorCal. I think I mentioned in a prior video. Can I sneak over here? Give it a shot. Wow, this is some sick biking, CJ. Ah, pretty good still. You know, there are some pretty amazing roads around Malibu up into the hills. Oh shit. Oh, what a nice, oh. <laughs> nice landing. And then we just go up that way. Yeah, there are some pretty nice windy roads up into the hills off, uh, what is that, Highway 1 or 101 or whatever? Highway 1? 101? You know, the one that snakes along the coast? If you turn inland around Malibu, around the beach, and you go up into the hills, there are some really nice windy roads. Uh, I drove up there in a five-speed Toyota Tercel once, which was kind of... <laughs> It was fun in a manual transmission, but it was not exactly... Make a right turn there, I guess. Oh shit, am I going the right way? Fuck. I'm going totally the wrong way, fuck. 
It was fun, but it wasn't exactly a performance car. This way. And I remember getting out of my car at the bottom of the hill, having driven in a somewhat spirited manner up. Up and then down, and I could, when I got out of the car, I could smell, well, as I was driving down, I felt my brakes start to go soft, which is a little bit concerning going down a hill. Oh, shit. And... Make a right turn there. And when I got out of the car, I could actually smell the brakes, so that was pushing it a bit too hard. I've never done that road, those roads on a motorcycle, but uh, they were pretty... I can imagine they would be pretty good. And then, and to get back slightly on topic, the, the whole Highway 1 up the coast... Am I going the right way here? Yeah, I am. The whole Highway 1 up the coast is actually pretty awesome from what I've seen. I've never even done it in a car because every time I drove up and down I-5, I really just wanted to get to where I was going as quickly as possible. And I was driving a car without air conditioning, an old Toyota Tercel, and when it's literally like 30, 36 or 38 degrees, you kind of just want to get the hell out of there. But, uh... Yeah, anyway. Enough reminiscing. Do what song fats up? You big string of gaggy fish! I see all the units with more balls than you! Okay. What the fuck do you want? Nothing. I'm looking for a friend of mine's cousin. Come on, she seems you totally sane. You? But Cesar said you was a real man. I am a real man, baby. I'm a god fair peace loving man of the people. Whatever, asshole. Let's go. Damn, relax, baby. <laughs> She seems Where's your car? normal. Where's yours? Uh, ladies don't drive themselves. That's what men are for. Oh, oh fuck you, goodness. lady. Thanks, Caesar. Appreciate this, homie. All right, let's get on my bike, baby. So, what's your name? Where we going? My name is Catalina, and we're gonna take this county for every stinking cent. Okay, good plan, I guess. You're damn straight. It's a good plan. I've cased four soft targets: a liquor store in Blueberry, a bank in Palomino Creek. A gas station in Dillimore, and a betting shop in Montgomery. Hold up, which one first? To the driver, you dumb pig, you choose! Okay. She seems charming. Uh, but if what they say Where about... Where are you from, huh, lady? <laughs> and what are you? Some laid-back gangbanger dude? I keep myself to myself, that's my style. Cesar says you got a brother in jail. Another brother dead, a mother just killed, and you got a bent cop on your case. I ain't listening to you. You think that is keeping yourself to yourself, eh, amigo? Real cool. You're just an idiota. And you're real charming, a proper lady. All right. Uh, great chemistry here to start. Hand over the tanking so I blow your fucking balls off. This is bulletproof glass. So you can just fuck off, bitch, before I call the sheriff. What are you doing, son? Just give her the cash. So yourself, maricon. Change of plan, girl! We're taking the tanker! Hey, what you doing? We're taking what? Okay. Okay, so we gotta... It hooks up automatically, nice. I ain't losing another crappy job because of some crazy bitch. Come on, Derek, we're gonna stop those bastards. Do I have to? Drive! I know a guy who'll pay for this rig and its cargo. Okay. Careful. Can I just take a peek at where we're going? So we'll go up to my marker and make a left. Pull alongside! That rig will crush us! Okay, easy it does it. I don't want to do this. Oh fuck. I'm losing health like crazy. Can I just crush him? Steady. How do Steady. I crush him? Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Can 
Can I just kill? We'll get ourselves killed. Man, what do I do? Am I going the wrong way? No, okay. Left. Yeah, I lost a whole shit ton of health there. Oh, nice. Okay, they didn't see me. Hello, Mr. Whitaker. Catalina, what have you brought me today? A rig and tanker, full to the brim with premium gas. Never seen it, never saw you, never gave you this water cash. Nice not doing business. Likewise. Now get out of here before the cops come snooping. If you ever want to run some freight for me, just drop in. I've always got shit to move. Goodbye. Okay, well, nice working with you too, Catalina. Oh, five grand, nice. Okay, got some money finally. So where's the next mission? Was she gonna call me? Ah, let's hijack the tractor. Am I gonna get a phone call or what's gonna happen here? Well, what do I do? Don't see any... Don't see any missions on the map. What do I... I guess I'm gonna get a phone call, huh? What's gonna happen now? I'm confused. Ah, a slow ass tractor. But anyway, I can tell the uh, if we end up dating Catalina, the sex is gonna be pretty crazy. <laughs> Cause she is nuts. What do I do now? Am I gonna get a Phone call or what? Or do I have to do I have to, to be on foot in order to get the phone call maybe? What do I I'm confused. Nothing in there. Nothing there. I'm supposed to stay out of Los Santos. I don't see anything to do there. So what do I do? Do I just... There we go. That's what I thought. Yeah. Carl. Who is this? You know me. This is the truth. No, I don't. Perfection. They said you were a moron. Who? <laughs> okay, you can drop the act now, kid. You the police? No. We have a mutual friend and business partner. We do? Who? Yes. Have you killed any cops lately? Oh man, Ten Penny. I should have known. That asshole. So I've got a room at a motel in Angel Pine. Make sure nobody follows you. Okay, so I guess we'll... What is that pie symbol? I guess we'll go to the pie. How far away is that? Oh, that's pretty fucking far. Okay, well I might just pause the video to save you guys the boredom of, uh... Boredom of having to watch me do this. Alright, be back. Alright guys, we're back. I got a hold of a motorcycle. Oh shit, watch where you're going, lady. And let's see what's shaking. Ah, ten pennies hanging around. Yeah. Ten pennies on that water too, huh? I wonder what water is supposed to be. Check this shit out. What do we have here? Yo, Carl. What up, kid? Hey, what's happening? Oh, uh, is this undercover training? Oh no, you must be off duty. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Hush up, man. 
Mr. Truth here is going to be supplying you with some of the finest. We and you are going to deliver it for us. Hey, man, you losing it. You hallucinating this shit. What? Oh. Yo, Truth, come here, man. Welcome, friend. Sup? Carl here is gonna be paying you your money. What you talking about? Now, Carl, I got a real do-gooder fucking with me, and I want you to take this evil green poison and drop it on him. <laughs> it's gonna ruin that asshole's career. Oh, bullshit. But dudes, you want mushrooms? You lose? How about some DMT? No, not for me, man. DMT? Is that the Joe it. Rogan joke? <laughs> DMT? <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> he must know Joe. Hunting elk Yo, together, Carl. doing DMT. <laughs> Whoa, man. I never thought I'd see that. A fed out smoking me. What? What are you, dude? FBI? DEA? Nah, I'm more like a private investigator. Friend, you give off a positive energy. How about some Vietnamese opium? Nah, I don't get in with that. But how do I know I can trust you? What, I'm working for you now? I'm a man of peace. But some squares across that ridge are not respecting my peace. <laughs> I mean, survivalist maniacs, right-wingers, fascists. Those fascists. They have a harvester, and I need one. Get it, then you can pay me. Wait, I'm gonna pay him? Namaste, Carl. The fuck that mean? Later, free. I like how they work the sort of California hippy dippy dude who's been like smoking weed <laughs> since the Haight Ashbury days in '67. And it was like a total deadhead, presumably. I, I like how they work that stereotype into the game. I gotta drive all the way there again? Holy fuck. Can I sneak across there, I wonder? Oh, somebody's car is going up. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Yeah, I was never really m much of a cruiser guy. Because I don't like... If you look at the cruiser, you can see how how like the, the feet are so far in front of the hips that it, it's like you're sort of sitting in a chair and you can't really use your if you're like I mean I don't I don't want to race on the street but if you want to ride in a little bit of, of a spirited fashion you kind of want to be able to, to use your legs and use your body weight and to do that you kind of need your feet kind of need them under you a little bit. Am I going the right way? So I need to go that way. Does that loop? Oh no, I gotta go back. So yeah, I, I like bikes where you're sort of, you know, it doesn't have to be like a race bike, but just something where you can ride in a little bit of a... Can I cut this way? I guess I picked the wrong bike for the job, sort of, but makes a nice sound. Maybe if I get on this trail? As long as I don't get destroyed by... Oh no, this is... Uh, maybe it's okay. No, I was worried it was going to be a super long... What do I 
do? Ah, oh, God, I'm getting... This isn't right at all. Well, if I can get on the road here... Holy shit, what is that? It's a flamethrower. Okay, well, we'll keep that in mind. How do I... So I, maybe if I get up this way... Oh, there's this frickin'... I'm too low down, it's way up there, I guess. Oh, I have to get up on the bridge, okay. So we'll get up here. That should take care of it. Can I get up? Ah, uh, how do I get up there? Can I run? Ah, look, you're in amazing shape, Carl. Yeah, just sprint up that hill like it's nothing, like you're some kind of NFL running back or something. All right, can I, uh... Hey, sir. Give up, home, boy. All right, you want to fight? What? Yeah, let's fight, lady. No money even? Ah, fuck. Oh, we got another bike here, all right. Okay, so... Yeah, just follow that all the way, okay. Oh, shit. I remember in Vice City, I, this was probably my favorite vehicle. I don't even know when I played Vice City. This was probably like 2002 or 2003 or something. This is quite a while ago. I played Vice City, I enjoyed it pretty thoroughly, and I think this was my favorite vehicle to cruise around Miami in, just because I liked the, liked the sound of it. Alright, here we are, finally. Combine Harvester. So we have to steal that? Survivalists, okay. Well, I guess we just gotta work our way through and, uh... Should I just... Ride in, maybe? You come to the wrong farm, boy! Yeah. Beat him down! It's all he's good for! Hey, what? who is this guy? Don't know, but it looks kind of shifted. Roll him in some pig shit. Roll him in some pig shit. All right, I got a shotgun, which is nice. Are they gonna come over here and fight? Uh, you want some? Ah. Shovel. Nice. Welcome to America. Man, I'm getting some good headshots here. Nice. So do I just hijack? I guess I don't want to run out in front of it because that'll probably be... Sayonara for me. So let's stay away from that. Can I just jack it? Do I have to shoot the guy who's in it? Here we go, excellent. Excellent. All right, and then I guess we can just run over the guys. Whoever dares mess with me is gonna 
How do I... Is there like a way out of here? Here, okay. Fellas, you want to get harvested? You want to get harvested, fellas? Oh boy, oh boy. You fellas want to get harvested? Ah, I just grease up the old internals with a little bit of human blood, eh? Oh shit, so I should go down this way. Ah, oh, fuck. I don't want them to damage the thing irreversibly. Am I going the right way? Maybe. If they just keep shooting at me, it might, uh... I think I'm gonna get out and deal with these guys. You gonna stay cool now. My gonna kill oh shit. Come on, man, move. Come on get up. Get in the fucking combine, you asshole. You're just gonna sit there? I didn't want to be... I would grab that ammo. No, not in the car, you dumbass. Get in the fucking combine. No, get in the fucking combine. Oh, it's over here. Shit, I was going in the back. Alright, so these were the guys who weren't respecting the truth's peace, huh? Let's see... So we make uh, go down this way, okay? Another pretty easy mission. I mean, most of these are pretty easy, honestly. I mean, I think I get... I get tripped up more by my own stupidity. Careful. I get tripped up more by my own stupidity than any real difficulty of the missions in general, but I think there might be some hard ones coming up, so... Man, you've brought peace back to my valley. Thank you, friend. I'll call you when the whoop to do is ready. Just make sure you get that cash. Carl and Caesar. What's up? Bad thinking shit, that's what's up, Holmes. What's wrong? Where's Kendall? Is she okay? She's with me. She's okay for now. The Varios Los Aztecas, it's all over. There's a price on my head. Maybe Kendall's too. What happened? Trust, respect, honor, they don't mean Jack and Los Santos now. My OGs, my S's, all dead or in hiding, eh? Get out of town. Head over to Angel Pine, rent you and Kendall a trailer, and I'll meet you there. Okay. I just got some shit to take care of, and uh... No, just get my sister out of town someplace safe. Don't shit with me on this one. I can't lose her, man. Sure thing, Holmes. We'll see you in Angel Pine. Alright, so... Mission passed. Alright, so that's where we're going now. Alright, I think I'll leave it there as it's about half an hour again. Uh, thanks for watching. I appreciate every like, subscribe, uh, share, notification, anything you do to help me out. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks a lot.